My name is Jeff Todd. I'm 28 years old from Bloomington, Indiana. I'm a native Hoosier born and raised and I'm out here in Venice, California, completely out of my element and I'm here to train with Joey Glor. Welcome to LA, bro. Nice to meet you. Good to see you in real life. Exactly. Figure out what you weigh, and then we'll set a goal for the time that you're out here. I know you're only going to be out here for two short months, yeah. a little bit less than that. Go ahead and get on the scale. Okay. All right, Jeff, right now you're 250 pounds, and at 250 pounds, you've got 60 days left. What do you, where do you want to be? I definitely have to get below 200. That's my big thing. Because you're, what, 5'10", 5'11"? Yeah, about 5'11 on a good day. All right, okay. <laughs> so uh, I think it's going to be a really, really hard goal to hit, but I think if we train every single day and you follow the diet and you do what I tell you to do, we can get there by the time you go home. 50 pounds in 60 days. All right, but it's got to start right now. You want to be a musician? We got a rock and roll here. Let's go. Make it happen. Two, one. Good. circuit training we're gonna have you lift some weights and yes you're gonna be doing diet which is, is the biggest part but the cardio is gonna be just slaying calories and getting that stomach to disappear I knew it was gonna to be tough coming out here but it's actually way tougher than I ever thought it would be even on the first day you know he didn't let me slack on the first day he pushed me way harder than I ever thought I was going to and I know that I got 60 more well 59 more days of this and it's gonna to be tough and uh, I'm pretty nervous about it Brutalities or mentalities? Up, chest up. Good. All damn day. Up. 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 Fire in the hole every time. Come on, Joe. So we came here for 15. 14. I actually almost gave up in the first week. I was packing my bags and ready to go home. But uh, Joey just happened to call me randomly and he convinced me to stay. And I've never been one to give up, but that's how hard it was. I was ready to head back home. And he was packing his bags and he was just done with this whole experience. He's only one weekend. So I, I, I told him basically in a nutshell um, how important this is to him, but also to me. And that he just needs to try and he just has to believe. I just hope that I can actually push through and get there. You know, Joey tells me every day that we're going to be fine and going to break through the plateaus and, and get down to 195 and lose the 50 pounds. And he just tells me, you know, to shut my mind off and let be. Let's go, Jeff. Let's get some weight loss. Let's get some weight loss. Does that help? <laughs> no. Stop laughing. No pressure. Stand right here in your personal space while you're doing these presses. Prepare you for the stage. The stage lights are on. You got to be ready to shred. Are you ready? <laughs> It's getting like feel the breath. You feel the breath on the nape of your neck, Jeff. Right now I'm telling him to just shut his brain off, stop getting emotional, just become a machine, show up, do the work, and it'll be over before you know it. Time's gonna time's gonna tick no matter what. And it's just how he spends this time that's gonna determine whether he has regrets or he has success. One, two, three, exercise. I wanna see more intensity. That's why I'm sick. That's why I'm counting down. Two, one. That'll do. Call one. Palms in. Palms out so you get the rhomboids and turns my all that stuff. Pull it in. Into the trap. 
At this point, his body is really begging for a break, and we can't give it to him until he's finally finished. He's got about a three-day drive back to Indiana when he's done, and that's when he can rest. Good, I like that shit up at the top. Five, good, you're good. Come on, four, three, come on now. Let's go down. Two, squeeze this. One, here we go. Good. Good. Four, four, three, come on. Chin up. Two, I got you. Good. One last rep. Actually, really confident that Jeff's gonna be able to pull this off because he's come so far already. I've seen what he's made of. He's a really, really tough guy. He's got a lot of heart for this, and and I, I feel like at this point there's no turning back. Then again, you never know what could happen. So until we get on that scale, I'm gonna always be a little bit nervous. We just have to see what happens on the final weigh-in. What's up, man? Last day. I know. Big final day. Uh, you got weight off your shoulders and off your stomach. I can tell you just your whole. Your whole you're all smiles right now. I can't wait. Let's get on the scale, man. Let's do it. There it is. We're going to turn again. You look incredibly different. I know when we first got on that scale, you weighed, well, how much was it? 200, like 250? 251 or something like wow. that. Wow. So 250 pounds. And now, two months later, after a whole lot of hard work, you ready to get on there and see what you weigh? I'm ready. I'm nervous, but I'm ready. So. Ready? Yeah. Chin up, don't look. Don't look. Look down, bro. You're 194. Awesome. You did it, dude. You did it. That's awesome. That's so amazing. I don't even know what to say. Man, I'm so, so proud of you. Thanks for doing it. I can't thank you enough. Someone tell you what this means to me. Honestly. You did great, man. Thanks, man. Yeah. You did awesome. I'm so proud of you, bro. You're, you're a new man. So Jeff weighed in at 194 pounds today, and I, I was just so happy for him. It was such a great number to see. That was his absolute biggest goal that he could imagine. You know, in the amount of time, two months that he had to train to lose 55 pounds, it was an incredible, incredible task. And, and now he's made the transformation, and you can just see it in everything that he does. And I'm, I'm just so excited to see what he's going to do next, because I know it's going to be great things. Here we are at 60 days later. Um, I lost over 55 pounds. It's incredible. I don't even have the words to express what I'm feeling right now. You know, the only thing I can do is just thank Joey because I know that I never could have done this without his help. You know, and I've still got a little ways to go. That's okay. I know what to do now to lose the last 10 pounds or whatever. So I just got to thank him again and thank everybody at Gold's and everybody that's worked with me here to achieve this goal because I couldn't have done it without all these people. It's just been amazing.